Good Monday morning to you guys. We're watching a severe potential weather setup coming in Wednesday for Michigan and also Southwest Michigan Tuesday night into the early morning Wednesday hours. We're also watching that closely. How Tuesday plays out will affect how Wednesday evolves. What I mean by that is there is a squall line that's expected to take shape out in Iowa, Missouri, and Illinois. And that's expected to push eastward towards Michigan, reaching us by, let's go ahead and say, overnight hours in Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, that time frame. If that does occur, and there's some questioning if it will occur, but if it does occur, that could potentially kill the severe risk for Wednesday by overturning the atmosphere, taking the instability out, not allowing the air to fully destabilize. So if that happens, just keep in mind that Wednesday is dependent on that happening. But if it doesn't happen or if it does happen and the atmosphere ends up recovering, which is a possibility, uh, we're talking a significant severe weather setup, including a potential for tornadoes, large hail, and damaging wind gusts. We're not going to get specific just yet. We're going to release a forecast later on tonight. But a quick dive into the model here. We're going to watch this warm front lift north. This is going to be Tuesday night. You can see the low pressure right over here over central north, uh, northeastern, northeastern Iowa. Swings a warm front through. Tuesday, bringing us into the mid 60s, Gulf moisture streaming up. So we're not going to have issues with moisture. We're not going to have issues with the warm profiles of temperatures. We're going to have a very unstable air mass. Instability profiles reaching 2000 surface base Cape, more than sufficient for severe weather. Wind shear profiles concerning um, supercells are possible if everything plays out right. Tornadoes, large hail, wind, like I said, significant severe weather is possible. SPC has highlighted eastern lower Michigan in a hatched area, indicating that significant severe weather. Um, is definitely possible in the eastern part of the state. So just want to keep an eye on as we head towards the Tuesday and Wednesday time frame. We're going to, like I said, post a forecast 5 p.m. tonight. Look for it. Be prepared. Have a plan. If you guys need help making a plan, contact us, message the page, email us. We'll help you. So just stay tuned, guys, and we will see you later.